So my neighbor called code enforcement for some bull crap. Hi, my name is Laura Sarasota County Code Enforcement. So we got them this basket over here. There's nothing mean about it. It's actually just a nice basket to welcome them. We could be jerks to them back and just like have a battle forever, but we don't, we're staying really quiet here. Like we don't do much. We're gonna move out of here soon anyway, but. Crackers. Oh, there's wine in here too. We just got this for you. That's all. That's so much better than what I used to do when I was a kid. Like we freaking would like, we did some messed up stuff to our neighbors. <laughs> Dude, I'm not, I can't even say it. She didn't even answer the door. She's like, oh, that's nice. Ah! Oh, that had her. Oh, that back flop though. So does that line stop it from going all the way to the pole? <laughs> <laughs> What's up, dude? It's been a while since I've seen you. I know. I got taller since last time, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you want to jump off with us? <laughs> I'll give you a boost. Yeah! <laughs> Bro, there is definitely a spring. I'm going to get a room. Okay. All right. Okay. Have a good night. Hi. Um, uh, I had a bad dream. Can I sleep in here with you? <laughs> um, I don't, I don't have a place for you to sleep here. Sorry. Can I just sleep? Can I just sleep right here? You don't want to sleep right there. Just in the corner? Um, I don't, I don't think so. But you're in what? Mmm. 2.37. I think. Oh yeah, okay. Can I just sleep here? In here with you? Is something wrong with the room? I just had a bad dream. Oh. Well, we can talk about it if you want. But we can't, we just can't like, sleep here. Can you at least come and check under my bed? Mm -hmm. Um, there's no underneath your bed. Well, I think I heard something. Okay, are you being serious? I don't, um, yeah, bad dream. Okay. Um, so, or just send someone to check under my bed. Okay. Um, let me see. Let me see what uh, I can I can do. Okay. Can I just see? sit here and tell you? No. Can you just check in my room? The bed? Well, there's no under the bed part of your... Maybe it's in the closet? Like, what is in your closet? Do you I don't know. Because I can't really go in the rooms, really. Okay. So, okay. Have a, have a good night, though. Bro, that's a fashion statement though. Yeah, it's pretty fresh. That's pretty cool looking. Okay. You know my friend Jake? I grew up with him. If I met him, I'm sure I would know him. <laughs> Isn't that the case with everyone? If I seen his face, I'd remember what he looked like. <laughs> <laughs> what size shoe are you? Uh, 11 and a half. They it's are. like how a little kid answers like, <laughs> 11 and a half. How am I driving? What a weird question, dude. How do you think he's driving? With his butt? Like, oh, well, he's steering with his butt. Obviously not. You have reached driver's alert. For calling driver's alert, may I have the vehicle number you're calling about? Yeah, it's CH5. All right, and what would you like to report? Well, uh, he just, he has uh, one hand on the steering wheel and then he has his mask on. And then uh, I see, I think his feet are on the, is on the gas pedal. Yes, and what, what what's he doing now? How's he driving? Um, well, it's he's using his feet on to press the gas, and then he's using like his left hand to to steer. Oh, 
Okay, and, um, all right. Okay, we'll notify their safety director. Um, oh, now both hands are on the wheel. Just wanted to help you guys out. Some ear protection, and then we just want to shoot. Right in the freaking neck. I'm ready, dude. I'm ready. I think we're ready for anything. Right in the neck, dude. Go. You want? You want to try it? <laughs> it has some kick. You want to go? You want to unload a clip? Let's be oh, careful. It's shoot, powerful. Just like a regular pistol. Yeah. Safety's on. JJ, let him shoot. Shoot it at a target. <laughs> Try all the way back. You gotta cock it. You never shot a gun before? Between each shot? Yeah. <laughs> What's that? What caliber is it? I think it's just a 22. Oh, okay. But it has some kick, you can feel it. To put some arc on the bullet, you know? Hey! hey. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> nice job. I would just want to make sure, like, if it ever comes down to it, that I got the skill to, you know, hit the target dead on. I don't want to have to use this and then one day, I, you know, I'm missing and huh. not able to protect myself. That's pretty deep. <laughs> God, so sketchy. Seeing the three wheeler drive through the field. I want to see a three-legged dog chasing after it. <laughs> the four-legged dog looks weird. You guys need to change that. <laughs> I know a guy. <laughs> you off-roading, brother? Huh? You off-roading? Yeah. How many skips can you get? Like, see this one? See how it's smooth on the bottom? It's a perfect skipping rock. <laughs> you gotta like throw it parallel to the ground, you know? Put a little arc on it so it hits yeah. center. Exactly. So anyway, short story long. <laughs> hey, what if I went up to people and like said and like told them a little story? And then, anyway, short story long, and then I just keep telling them, keep going, keep it. But short story long, and just keep going and going and going. But you ever seen shorts sag this much though? Man, I got shorts on shorts. When I was a kid, and my mom would put my clothes in the microwave and say, "Ooh, it's nice and warm. Put them on real quick." <laughs> Didn't your mom do that too? Yeah, she's bringing warm clothes. You're like, no, not in the microwave. She used the oven. Imagine all the radiation on my legs and balls. <laughs> I like going hunting with Nerf guns. That way I don't actually hurt the animals. I only just, shoot elephants. Just give them a little spook. <laughs> <laughs> I just like to spook them. <laughs> right in the neck, dude. Right in the neck. <laughs> Good job, partner. Good job, domestic partner. <laughs> putting putting fake boobs on Cole. Oh yeah. And then breastfeed my son. <laughs> In public. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. In public, that is good. Man breastfeeding his child in public. <laughs> Dude, that is good. That's like that is good. That's perfect for you. <laughs> Or in the middle of like the mall or something. Man breastfeeding child in public social experiment. Oh yeah, uh, oh, well, the caption could be like, if the, uh, if this offends you, you can unfriend me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like it's something you're, you're so passionate about it. And now, uh, so we're just gonna wait. We got a nice view of the pool. Watch me skinny dip later tonight. <laughs> when I was like 16, me and my friends used to like run around naked all the time on golf courses and like, Wait, are you recording? What's up here? There's like there's a little a Little dog up there. You can keep your cactuses up there. 
I keep my nails and my hammer. And <laughs> <laughs> oh, I keep a keep a piano up there. <laughs> so you can keep an anvil up on your side and a piano on my side. <laughs> oh, I'm just driving down the road and all of a sudden a piano comes down and it's raining an anvil. Oh, no, God dang it! It's raining an anvil. Like, piano's outside. One of those like lumps pops up out of here. Man. First ball! Man. Hey. <laughs> oh my god! The sound of it hitting his tooth! <laughs> uh, I'm just, I'm totally, I'm just joking with you. I'm just joking around. <laughs> Are you really? Are you being serious? <laughs> <laughs> it's a joke! <laughs> you <serious? laughs> I was like, I don't want to be mean. <laughs> You're so nice. <laughs> When you asked if it was a joke, it was so hard not to laugh. You weren't laughing. I know. <laughs> My manager was like, lock the doors. <laughs> that was so funny. Do you remember me from earlier when I came in? <laughs> yes. To check in? Yeah, and that's what I said. I was just saying to my manager, I was like, he seems so normal. <laughs> <laughs> Bullseye. Bullseye on every shot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>